Hey guys, it's Harv, good to see you. So recently I picked up the Rode Wireless Go system and I will do probably a full review or some sort of comparison or how to get the best sound out of video for these, but I thought for today I'll just give you my first impressions and uh, I hope you enjoy it. But before we do, a couple of days ago I put out a video that I really think you're going to find helpful. It's my how to get the most out of S-Log3 using the A7S III video. There's tons of tips and I, it's a really fun video, I really think you're going to enjoy it, I will link it below for you. And of course it would mean a lot to me if you could show some love to the channel by hitting the notification bell next to your subscribe button. Anyway, let's get into it. So I just want to preface this video by saying I love Rode, I think they're a great company, they make really good products for filmmakers. But the first impression I got from this product was when I got the box, and it's it's not good. Basically, there is no way to get into this box without ripping open. And for someone like me, who I buy and sell gear fairly frequently, this isn't good. This means I either have to ship it without a box, or I have to do some sort of dodgy repair job. It's basically glued in. It's glued down, so you have to rip it open if you want to get in. Come on, road. Next, looking at the instructions. They're small, they're simple, and I would say personally, they are needlessly simple. Honestly, it all it really tells you to do is to turn them both on, turn the receiver and the transmitter on, and they will sync. That's, that's all it tells you. You can work out more by looking at the units yourself. What I wanted to know from the instructions was the best way to use it, the optimum gain setting, the best position to have it on you. Um, so with this lack of information in mind, I'm gonna find out these things and make a video for you. So watch this space. And then I checked out the actual transmitter and receiver and I have to say, they are absolutely first rate in terms of build quality. One thing I really love is the display on the receiver. It's just so amazing. Let me just see if I can get that closer for you. In terms of convenience, this really couldn't get much better. It's such a small package and just so quick to set up and um, what an incredible product. Tell you what, I'm going to switch over, put this on and show you what it sounds like. So usually I record these videos with my awesome AKG condenser mic which is just here. Let me just quickly move it into shot, it's right here. And I love it because it sounds so full and natural and rich. So let's switch over now to the Rode and this is what it sounds like. As you can see, I've got a position just here and this isn't ideal because, you know, it's a black clip on a white t-shirt. They actually do a white version if you're someone that wears more white than black. I'm also not convinced that this is the very best position for the mic. I mean, it's, it uses an Omni mic which picks up sound from all directions. So I suspect that maybe sort of centre of chest might be better, but I'll have to try it and let you know what sounds best. Speaking of convenience again, and it comes with this handy Rode pouch, which just fits the transmitter, receiver and cable that come with this. You can connect your own lav mic if you want to, but I think the strength of this product is its convenience with just being able to record like this with just the transmitter and receiver. I would recommend checking out Caleb Pike's 10 tips of using the Rode Wireless Go system because it's a really good video. There's some genuinely good tips in there and I'll link his video as well below. My video on this will focus on this very simple setup and how to get the very best sound out of it. I'll look at different positions, different gain settings, and then how to post-process it to get it sounding the best it possibly can be. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this first thoughts slash impressions of the Rode Wireless Go system. I've certainly enjoyed making it for you, and I'll catch you next time. See you guys. Mm -hmm.